Hi, I'm Ken Bianco from Train World TV, and we got Lionel here today at your TCA train show, and Ryan, my man. All right, back, <laughs> back again. again. Back yes. again. It feels like it was yesterday we were talking to Ryan about some new products, but we got a whole big wall, legacy engines, um, whole Ryan, lots of new stuff. I yeah. mean, we were just together a few weeks ago, yep. and literally all this wall came in as samples in the last couple of weeks cool. uh, in time cool. for New York. So. Start with the, the big steamers, I guess. Yep. Uh, we've got a, a deco sample of our AC9. This is the Southern Pacific scheme. Now the deco sample here has some striping differences from the one in the catalog. We're getting all that corrected, so it'll match the, the catalog art when it's delivered. Okay. But the colors really pop on this engine. We had it running on our uh, display layout. So the S2, what exactly, how'd you guys make it? Uh, what's the process? And uh... Very cool engine, uh, very compact. So there's lots of stuff going on inside under the hood here. Uh, these electrics themselves are amazing locomotives. About 70 years-ish in, in service. I mean, just an incredible lifespan. Uh, so it's an all die-cast body, as you can see, loaded with uh, extra add-on detail parts. Been well over a decade since we cataloged this. Made a few changes to it. We've added Legacy for the first time. We added the really cool swinging bell feature, so when you ring the bell, this will actually swing back and forth. Really? Mm -hmm. That does it automatically? Automatically, yep. You don't have to do it like... No, no, the no. There's, a, uh, there's a magnet and a reed switch underneath there that, that pulls the... Wow. Uh, very cool. Uh, sprung panographs. Uh, on this version, we've also made some changes to the roof. Uh, these locomotives later in their career had uh, radiator coils added to the roof. So we wanted to backdate it a little bit. So two of the versions are like this with the clean as-built roof. This is right. for the uh, NY uh, C&H scheme and then also for the template inspired set that, we, that we're doing. And then the later versions will still have the correct piping on the roof as well. So Very nice. you have it both ways there. Uh, a really great engine, all die cast, so even though it's uh, wow. it's little, yeah. just like this, the real Very engines, uh, it's got all the pulling power you're ever going to need. A lot of intricate de detail, piping. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Yeah, this is going to be very, very popular. Mm -hmm. Already is taking a lot of pre-orders on it. Nice unit. Yeah. Nice. Really, cool, really cool locomotive. Uh, looking at some of the other great scale pieces we have here. You know, everyone's been asking and asking and asking about the 21-inch passenger cars. We've got a whole bunch of tooling samples here from those. Um, I think all together we've got about 19 new cars planned. Uh, we've got tooling samples here for about 14 or so, maybe a little more. Uh, from the various sets, we've got the Union Pacific set, uh, some of the Tennessee cars, including the two-unit diner, uh, some of the various Penn Central, New York Central cars. Uh, so a whole bunch of sleepers and observations. And running on the layout, we have a 3D printed sample of the new theater car with the camera on board in the back. Uh, you know, a lot of people have been asking about that. Yeah. Very different, unique, and the camera actually comes with the train. So that's uh, pretty awesome. Put it on the track, download the app, and away you go. We've been uh, showing it off on cell phones here as well as uh, monitors in the booth. Uh, so people can see it on the big screen. It's a, it's a really cool car, really lot, really fun feature. And kids have been having fun, you know, waving to themselves as the train goes by. All right, so let's uh, go down there. Let's check out some non-legacy stuff. Sure, let's do it. Okay, Legacy Plus, a great mid-range level product. So for those who want a lot of the features that uh, come with the, the higher end scale engines or our traditional engines, but in lower price point and just everything's much more easy to use than the, the larger Legacy remote, Lion C Plus is your answer. Right. So we've got uh, several locomotives here on display. We've done uh, multiple body styles and steam and diesel engines. Uh, lots of color on this wall. Uh, a couple of prototypes. We've got the new Berkshire prototype and the SD60M. Wow. Again, this is the first time we've tried the... This is Lion Chief Plus? This is Lion Chief Plus. So wow. this is, uh, again, first time we've taken a scale engine uh, with all the same details of the Legacy version, but changed out the electronics so that you have the Lion Chief Plus features that's and the Lion Chief Plus uh, price point. Yeah, that's going to be a home run piece. Lion Chief Plus has now gone scale. <laughs> Correct. And these are all now Bluetooth uh, starting this year going forward. So you can run it with the remote that comes with the engine. You can run it with your conventional transformer. Or you can run it with a universal remote. Or you can download an app 
and run this off of your cell phone or smart device. So how do we know if it's uh, smartphone enabled? So, so anything going forward? Anything going forward will be Bluetooth. So anything okay. we deliver this year and beyond. Okay. Uh, we've delivered a few Bluetooth engines already. The American Flyer Northern, the HO Polo Express, okay. uh, the uh, American Flyer Docksider that's uh, shipping now. Right, right, right. Uh, those all have Bluetooth on board. Uh, so it's already out there and some people have been trying it. Oh, we've had cool. people playing with it here at the show. It's uh, a lot of fun and nice. really easy to use. And how did they download the app? Uh, you, right now it's the uh, Apple version, so you go to the Apple Store, type in Lionel or Lion Chief, right. and you'll, it'll come up in your search uh -huh. engine. It's a free download, and away you go. That's great. And these uh, engines coming out as well will be Bluetooth? These new Makatas coming out will be Bluetooth. You can see some really great color schemes yeah. on these. We've got the uh, Halloween Deco on, on this one, the Presidential Makata, which works great with the I'm sure uh, this President's Fox Cars. going to go crazy right now. Um, anything uh, America is uh, very popular right mm -hmm. now. Uh, the Halloween engine, very cool, unique. Yeah, this will have some great special sounds in it as well to, to fit with the theme. Okay. But, I think really this great. was a home run. I think we're actually sold out, but the Reading and Northern, the blue is just unbelievable. Really it was really great. Out. And uh, we'll be doing some more Pacifics in the not too distant future. Lots of great colors coming your way. So. Sounds good. Well, thank you very much, All Ryan. Right, no problem. And let's kick it over to uh, Megan. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> How's it going? <laughs> All right. So this is Megan from uh, Lion Out, mm -hmm. and let's talk about, I guess, everyday rolling stock. <laughs> everyday rolling stock. And um, sorry, I lost my voice. It's been a very good show. <laughs> um, like I said, I'm, I'm chatty, so. Um, yeah, all of our traditional rolling stock and sets we've got come out. Um, it's actually been really exciting because this is my first York to present as being a project manager okay. for this. Cool. So wow. we actually worked really hard to get a lot of deco samples so we could show not just our, our, our hobbyists but also our dealers, wholesalers, what they're, what they're expecting this year. That's awesome. Um, so you're going to see some of your basic names. A lot of the licensed sets, we are actually going through licensure approval right now. But okay. You guys will not be disappointed. Awesome. It's very, very, very awesome. Good. So we've got, you know, traditional uh, regular holiday set. We've had a lot of good reaction to um, the Five Star General, which is kind of that throwback to 1961. Right, 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 right. Um, so everyone loves the general engine, the extra detail, that kind of thing. Yep. Um, of course, the Alaska and additional rolling stock that kind of goes back with it. We also have a very good representation of some of our licensed pieces that are coming in. That's great. So. And one thing I got to say, your, the artwork on some of these cars are just unbelievable. Mm -hmm. I know, the, right? The detail, the, the image it's just crisp it's unique different and you absolutely. guys are coming out with some awesome rolling stock pieces absolutely and you know the one thing for me is is um, going into this kind of doing the sets and, and being a mom I want to have playback right I got to get them to get to a point where um, they uh, you know the kid wants to bring it out and add to yep. it and do yep. that so yep. I think you're seeing the future a lot more of that um, right as right, we're planning. Right. And so cool. I'm really excited cool. to see what you guys think. And um, you know, a lot of the sets do have the, that play value. Yeah, yeah. And a lot of a lot of different box cars. And Lionel is now announcing uh, certain surprise box cars oh, yeah. uh, at random times yes, of the year. Yes, yes. And you're not going to be disappointed. Okay. Such All right. great graphics. Cool. Made in the USA, US imported parts. So okay. nice turnaround, but Very you will good. not be disappointed. That's great. Well, thank yeah. you so much. Yeah, not a problem. And uh, you could get all your Lionel product at trainworld.com. Shop online at trainworld.com for all your Lionel product. We're taking back orders on some of the high-end legacy e engines that are coming out and um, a lot of new arrivals, so keep on checking in. And thank you guys.